Vic, I'm out of options. Alex has been in South America for two years now, and I haven't heard from him in six months. I just know something is wrong, and I don't trust the horrible preachers he's fallen in with. Can you get in there and check on him? With your background, I know you can handle it. Get him out if things look bad. I know it's been a few years, but your family. God, he's still just a kid. Stella. All right, looks like we got some Jamestown stuff going on. All right, let's head out. Of options. Alex has been in South America for two years now, and I haven't heard from him in six months. Dear Mom, things are going great down here. I knew it would be hard working with the mission to build a town in the jungle, but it's what we have to do. It stays hot and humid year-round here, but I love seeing all the bugs and birds from South America. Oh, food's great, particularly because we grow it ourselves. I know you worry about me, but... Please don't. Love, Alex. Hmm. I've never trusted those people. Who would with a name like Collective Justice Mission? They exploit good people like Alex, get them to hand over all their money, make them work all hours, and put them in a dangerous camp in the jungle. So many horrible rumors about what they do down there. I thought about what you said. Maybe some of those people are sincere. Maybe Freedom Town is a good side. But Vic, what if you're wrong? You have to find Alex. You were off doing your own thing in Brazil, Vic. That's fine, but Alex missed you. When his dad left, he could have used someone else to look up to. Someone to be a guidepost. By myself, I, I couldn't be that for him. So Alex went out and found his guidance somewhere else. Now look where he is. I need you to find him. I got a map to the area they're living in. They must have more detailed ones. I hope you find a better one when you're inside. That'll help you find Alex. Okay, so let's check the map. I'm to read this map. Well, it looks like we have to go north. And we're at the bottom. Let's make our. Do you know why we named this place Freedom Town? We named it for the freedoms America promised us, but which we never really had. At last, here we are free to love our God. And love ourselves as America would never let us. We only ask that you love this place. As we love all of you. One bullet. Cuba, the children are learning of that country's great triumphs, seeing how steadfast defiance led to a much more egalitarian society. There, they will learn of the great promise of socialism, while here, we contemplate its cost. A small community, my people. And to make this a success, 
So those outlines that you see, the red, that's where they're looking. And if you break that, then they can tell who you are since we have a uh, imperfect skies. So I just threw a rock to distract. plan anyway just the one of you i was expecting a squad or a platoon but it doesn't matter soon nothing you've done will matter at all from Matthew about the city on the hill, I think of our town in the jungle, how we can be an example to the world. The Puritans preach that their shining example would be Boston, but 300 years later it is instead a corrupt home for fake progressives and powerful elites. A betrayal. No life at all would be better than a life of American hypocrisy. We will be true to our principles, whatever end may come. said justice was going to be easy or comfortable. If you want to go back to the comforts of the U.S., come talk to us. If we can't convince you what a mistake you are making, then there is no place for you here. <laughs> here they guy. Time 
when we must decide our future. We will leave an indelible mark on history and show them how we reject their vile lies. We forge our own path out of this darkness, escaping with the providence only the Lord can grant us. And we will inspire others to realize this world is cruelty, that it is time for a final reckoning. Slip. Okay. How can we get past these guys? Every day's a gift and we must use it while we can. Working 
It's about a cult. And we have to... I have to go Injustice, in this purple ring and find a person to talk to. So we're trying to find clues. And we're trying to rescue a person's nephew or son out of here. I believe it's the nephew. Might be her. Her. The mother wants her son back, I believe. And he's the contact is somewhere in this area. But we have to dodge these little areas here. Looking for something green. person could be unless they're on the other side of this river reason why they can't really see me is because I have a sort of a disguise on. Yeah, I have a gun. I have a shotgun. But those guys that are in red, if I start shooting, which I don't have that... Hold on. That, the, the guys right there in the red, they have guns too, and there's a whole lot of them. But... I only have one bullet and six bullets in my pistol, so I won't be able to take them all out. And it giveth light unto all that are in the house. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father who is in heaven. Oh, there it is. There's a person I need to talk to. I think people died here. You must be the reason for all the alarms I've been hearing. I've got an achievement. You here to hurt us? I came here to find a good home for my boys. I loved what my kids would learn here, about justice for everyone. But this place is too... intense. Now, everywhere I look is danger. Things are coming to a head. I wish I could go get my kids and run, but they're off in Cuba. I don't even know where. I need an address, anything, before I can think of leaving to go get them. I miss the kids, but part of me is glad they aren't here right now. This is a hard time for all of us, but I still miss them. It's like Jamestown, man. For a time, I thought Isaac would be a role model for my boys, but the last few months, Isaac has changed. He's not a role model anymore. The walkers really do value the children. Rebecca said once, if the worst happened, if they came for us, at least the children might live on. Remember what happened to us, and they might succeed where we failed. We're all together, but it's so hard to just survive in this place. Why didn't the walkers have kids? Is it weird that I think it's weird? Please don't tell anybody I said that. You want to find Alex? He's your family? Oh, he's a good kid. Let me see your map. He's in this section. Okay, so now we have to search this whole blue area here. 
for Alex. All right. Search the white chapels to find the children's location. Teresa. Uh, this might be a little rough. So what are the white chapels? I hope they're like churches or something. I'm sure he'd like to see you. Just like I want to see my boys. Why didn't the walkers have kids? Is it weird that I think it's weird? Please don't tell anybody I said that. All right. So we need to go. It's like we gotta head west. We can take the long way around. This is gonna be rough. Find Kian. She may help you find. Maybe by the river. Check you know out. how much you all mean to us. All right, let's just go straight but up. We are coming to a crisis point in Freedom Town. A time when we must decide our future. We will leave an indelible mark on history and show them how we reject their vile lies. We forge our own path out of this darkness, escaping with the providence only the Lord can grant us. And we will inspire others to realize this world is cruelty, that it is time for a final reckoning. Make sure I still get my stuff. Okay. The ones that have like the red around, those are the more violent ones. And the ones that are yellow, they're like in the middle. And the ones that are green are the ones that you can approach safely without probably getting shot. From Jeremiah 22, thus says the Lord, do justice and righteousness, and deliver from the hand of the oppressor him who has been robbed. And do no wrong or violence to the resident alien, the fatherless, and the widow, nor shed innocent blood in this place. He said by the river, didn't he? What in the world's going on over there? Dead people. They're gonna kill somebody. From Romans 13. Let no debt remain outstanding, except the continuing debt to love one another. For whoever loves others has fulfilled the law. The commandments, you shall not commit adultery, you shall not murder, you shall not steal, you shall not covet, and whatever other command there may be, are summed up in this one command. Love your neighbor as yourself. Love does no harm to a neighbor. Therefore, love is the fulfillment of the law. La Palma, learning about the revolution from our trusted neighbors. Out of the mouth of babes hast thou ordained strength, that thou mightest still the enemy and the avenger. When we send our strongest message, we do so knowing it will make the world better and all children will benefit. These are hard decisions, but we must make them, for God has made us his messengers. I think I found him. Vic, 
Those alarms were because of you? You've scared people. They're freaking out. You need to go. It's not safe for you here. We brought hatred down here with us. Can't ever get away from what's in you. They tell us about friends dying from malaria, right? But those friends didn't die from malaria. They died from disobeying. Let me see your map. This is where Isaac and Rebecca are. Maybe you can do something. Somebody has to do something. Hmm. Right. Whew. All right. So we gotta search the white chapels for the children's location. And Kian, she may help find Alex, which we've already found him. I lost my faith in this town a while ago. Now that you're here, I know it's time for me to go. You can take me with you, right? Did you ever believe in something? I mean, really. And then have it turn out to be deceit and treachery and just fucked up? Isaac did that to me. Rebecca talks about the atrocities of the US. Maybe she should just take a look around this town. I can't believe mom had you come all the way down here. She never understood this place, what it did for me. We fought on that. I thought when I was gone, she wouldn't have to worry. She finally get rest. Seriously? Instead, she sent you. Oh, um, what? What murderous empire builds enough weaponry to kill everyone on the planet ten times? Hey. Of course we know you've been here for a while. What we don't know is if you've already poisoned us. Is it in the water, the food, a chemical in the air? Down with him. Well, actually, we're right in the area we need to be. Revolutionary leaders were killed right there. I see when they it. said no to the war machines. And so how do we get over there? Uh, looks like we, we have refuse to, go straight to fight down. for profits, and that makes us dangerous. We fight only our own fight. Our surveillance tells us they are sending forces to destroy us because they so fear what we represent. When people question how we have chosen to arm ourselves, I ask, what choice do we have? We dream of a peaceful world, of course. But as Castro said, a revolution is not a bed of roses. We are ourselves to control our own fate. Born sleeping on a bed of gold, they preach their great accomplishments when all they have done is perpetuate a system that robs you blind. And they ask why the poor don't work harder, why the black mother has so many children, why anyone should have a moment's peace when they could work for starvation wages to line the pockets of the wealthiest. Who gave you the right to question? Who gave you the right to refuse their system? We did. States is take slavery and dress it up in new clothes. They don't allow you enough food to live, a decent school to send your children, health services, not in your neighborhood. And once you are old, you're just a used up slave. They won't even do you the dignity of taking you out back and putting a bullet in your head. They suck away what money you have left, leaving you to die in a slow tragedy. Hmm. Kidding. We will never know 
Ooh. paradise if we do not claim it. That is why we built this place, and why we must keep building. Everyone to the church. Now, my people. Hmm. All right, so I have a disguise now. Somewhat. I really have to find some health. To the church. There is a meeting in the church. This is the time. Much time. Gosh, how am I gonna get past those? I got an idea. Everyone, please hurry. This is the time. Oh well. Formation team members are distributing pills. Do not worry, we have enough. We have prepared for this day. I have tried to make this a world worth living in. I have tried so hard. We all have. And now I confess to you. Everyone line up. Two pills each. This will be over soon. So they moved. Oh man. So we have to go all the way back over there? It's hmm. peaceful this end. It's our choice. They would tear us apart. They know we are weak when we are separated. But as one, our voices will be deafening. So they're all at the church, I'm assuming. There is no time left. We have given our lives to this great cause. We have tried, my people. Tried to live here. 
in a world that does not want us. Just take the pills, and we can bring this to the end. We lived together. Please, 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 let us die together. I lost my faith in this town a while ago. Now that you're here, I know it's time for me to go. You can take me with you, right? I can't believe you came for me. I lost hope. Thanks. You got a plan for getting us out, right? This is our deliverance. This is our rebirth to a better world. Okay, I'll wait here. ourselves and those we leave behind. All right. I trust you, Vic. Come on, let's go. Okay. We just go down. <gasps> You're dead. Look at those. When I think it through, it's clear. All I've ever known is lies. So... Let's go left. Reason why I keep stopping and doing that, I just want to make sure I don't run into anyone. Hoping I'm doing this right. What? Hmm. One hundred and five students. Okay, so So I'm at the insertion, I don't know what else to do. Maybe that's it over there. Oh God! Oh God! <laughs> well, at least I'm healing. Huh? That's a good thing.
what happened? What's this? Yep. Oh, hold on. What is that? I go down that way. When I think it nope. through, it's clear. All I've ever known is lies. Hey. Look at here. Now, how did I get over here? How in the world did I get over here? Alex is having a hard time, but at least he's alive. When I think of those people, those people were so lost. <laughs> I guess it wasn't a bug after all. I just couldn't find my way. Very interesting. Very. At the coming of the night, we all must look behind and see if we can see what lies inside. At the falling of the light, we hope that we can find the path that we have walked without a guide. All the points along the way places where we lie, the causes we have lost and we have won. Was it worth a single day to soothe our foolish pride and do the many things that we have done? Wow. So there's one, two, three, and four, we're five, lost along the way. 20, along the way. 19 different endings. Wow. So I guess if I could have got to the prosperity preachers then I could have changed their minds possibly. Ooh, you get extra stuff. Okay. This has been the Church in the Darkness, which I thought was when a look into was the bugged, sun, but apparently it wasn't. The face of God. We're lucky so it's an interesting game. From going blind. Probably have to give it a you know five or six more playthroughs just to see run, what has changed. We can improve the odds. <laughs> the well, I, I guess it's going to be a challenge. All right, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And we lost along the way. Lost along the way.